With the Olympics coming up, we thought it would be fun to draw another athlete. Yeah. Who are we going to draw this time? A volleyball player. Yeah, we hope you're going to follow along. You need your drawing supplies. We always like to use markers, but you can use a pencil. You also need some? Paper and something to color with. Yeah. All right. You ready to start? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's first draw our volleyball player's head. We're going to draw it over here on the right. And we're going to draw them jumping up like they're going to spike it or maybe they're doing a jump surf. So let's draw two eyes. We're going to draw two circles, but watch this. I'm going to draw one. Maybe the, the first eye is kind of in the middle of the paper, but towards the top. And then we're going to draw the second eye, but we're not going to go straight across to the right. We're going to draw it tipped slightly so that they, they're going to look like they're looking up at the volleyball. So we're going to draw another circle, the same size. Then let's draw the highlights like we always do. A small little circle on the top left, and then we can color in the big circle, but leave that little circle white. This makes the eyes look shiny and reflective and also friendly. And cute. Yes, and cute, of course. You could even add eyelashes if you want. I'm going to draw a boy volleyball player. You could draw a girl volleyball player. Next, let's draw the mouth. I'm going to draw a curve like this, and then you could draw a different mouth if you want. I'm gonna draw. Mm, I'm gonna draw the mouth open, and maybe teeth inside. So I'm gonna draw a line down, and then connect to the inside. Open. <laughs> I love that. It's <laughs> a cute mouth. I'm gonna draw another line coming up, and then color in the bottom part. Now let's draw the shape of our volleyball player's head. I'm gonna start on the left side of the eye. We're gonna curve down underneath the mouth, and then curve back up next to the other eye, but look, see how the shape, the U shape is kind of tipped also. Now let's draw ears. We're going to draw the letter C on the left and a backward C on the right. Now we could draw the hair. And you could draw curly hair. I'm going to draw straight hair. So I'm going to draw little spikes like this going across to the other side. Mine's going to be bumpy hair. Oh, I like it. Curly. Or curly hair, yeah. You could really change the hair any way you want. Then let's draw the outside shape of the hair. I'm going to draw more spikes. Well, maybe even like really crazy spikes. I'm going to go all the way over to the other side. And you could draw curly hair on the top. Change the bumps going, yeah, just like that, going the other way. That looks awesome. <laughs> you could even add longer hair, but maybe do that after we draw the arms and the body. Right here we're going to draw the front of our volleyball player. We're going to draw the shirt. So we're going to draw a curve going this way. And then let's draw the back of the shirt. We're going to draw a curve that kind of matches too. And this one, let's draw it a little bit longer. And then let's draw a line straight across and connect. Then we're going to draw another line that comes further back. See how it's curving to the right? This is for the shorts. And then we can draw another curve up here on the front. And this one's longer, but it matches this first curve that we drew here. Next, let's draw the inside of the shorts. I'm going to draw a tall upside down V in between. And then we can connect. I like yours. I like your shorts. They're going to be skinnier than my shorts. That's cool. There you go. We connected the bottom of the shorts. Now we can draw the legs. Let's draw a short line that comes out of the shorts, and then we're going to draw a longer line that comes back further. Now let's draw the front of the leg. We're going to start here. We're going to draw another line that comes down to the knee, and then we're going to curve or draw another diagonal line coming back further to the right. Now let's draw the shoes. We're going to draw a U shape, comes down, curves back up, and connects to the other side of the leg. Yeah, you did it. Let's repeat those same steps for one more leg. We're going to have two legs, right? Yeah. So we're going to draw the back of the leg first. We're going to draw a short line coming down and then a longer line. Then let's do the front of the legs. We'll draw the knee and then come down to the ankle. And then we can draw the U shape for the shoes. Let's add more details for the shoes. We can draw the bottom of the shoe. So we'll draw another curve that comes around on each foot. 
This shoe is bigger than this one. Yeah. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> then let's draw the top of the shoe. We can draw two curves for each foot. Then let's draw the socks, or this could also be the bottom of the knee pads too. And then let's draw another one that's on top of the knees for the knee pads. Oh, we could also add two lines for the shoelaces. And we could also add the little tongue on top of the shoe. Let's draw a upside down or sideways U. Nice, now let's draw the arms. Let's draw the first arm coming down this way, and then we're gonna draw it coming back up. Then let's draw the other side of the arm. We're gonna start at the armpit, come down to the elbow, and then up to the wrist. Now let's draw the hand. We can draw the thumb first. We'll draw an upside down U. Then we're gonna come up and then down. That's for the little line right here. So let's draw the, the fingers coming out of that line. I'm gonna draw a really tall upside down U. We're just gonna draw three fingers to keep it simple, cartoon hand. We're gonna draw another one that comes out and then connects down to the wrist. Now let's draw the other arm. We're gonna just draw it coming straight out in front. And then we can draw the other side of the arm coming forward too. So we start at the armpit. I get a little further away at the wrist. And then let's draw the hand also. Let's repeat those same steps. We could draw the thumb. Then we'll draw the line coming up and then down for the palm. And then we'll draw the fingers. We're gonna draw a sideways tall U shape. Another one. And then one more and then this one connects into the wrist. What are we missing? The volleyball. Yeah, it just looks like somebody's jumping. <laughs> <laughs> Let's draw the volleyball. We're gonna draw a circle right here. Then right here in the middle, let's add a guide point. And then we're gonna draw a curve coming up and connecting to the top of the ball. Then we'll come back to that guide point and we're gonna draw a curve coming over to the left side. And then we're gonna draw, come back to the point and draw a curve coming down to the right. And they should all be curving in the same direction. Like a fan. It does look like a fan, you're right. Now let's add more of those lines, we're gonna draw two lines up in this top shape that come over to the right side. Then let's start down here and we're gonna draw two curves going this way. And then on this one, we're gonna draw two curves going this direction. That's a pretty simple way to draw a volleyball. Yeah. We did it, Hadley. Oh, do you want to add longer hair to your drawing? Yes. That would be awesome. Well, oh, that's really cute. Now we're not completely done. What do we still need to do? We still need to color it. Yes, this part will fast forward, but at the end you can pause the video to match our same color, or you could color your drawings any way you want. You ready to fast forward? Yeah. we finished coloring and drawing our volleyball player. It looks so much better colored in. Yeah, I think so too. I hope our art friends are gonna color their drawings too. And it looks like we colored ours of USA. Yes. But you guys could color your drawings any way you want. We also added a little shadow down here at the bottom with our gray marker, and that really makes our volleyball player look like they're jumping up in the air. You could also add a background like the net. Oh yeah, and also maybe the other players on the team. And people cheering them on. Oh, that would be really cool. We had a lot of fun drawing your volleyball player. And we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.